Hey, what's going on, guys? Punch one here, and welcome back to Wolf Among Us. In the last episode, we things are gonna go too well for us. You know, we got we ended up getting everything's ended up hitting the fan. I mean, you'll see it in the. No, we save you won't. Uh, sorry, I mean, you, uh, we ended up getting shot down, and Crane got taken. So, yeah, that was the ending of episode three. But today, we're saying we are playing episode four. So let's hope things are to go our way a little bit more. Um, so suggesting by this image, I do not believe it will. I do not believe it, uh, I do not believe it will. But hey, let's hope. Let's just hope. So that's it, let's get on started. Start the episode 4. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. Oh it's god, what's happening? simple as that. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? Okay, but I like here. It's missing a piece. Uh oh, Crane must have taken a shot. Yep. The open arms. Enjoy your stay. Thanks, Indeed. Big B. And thanks for covering for me last time too. Yep. Big B? How could you uh -huh. do this to me? I that guess down. I finally see you for who you are! Tell me who did it! Just tell me who did it! I know you know! I don't think he did it. Of course he didn't. Look at least I think I don't think he's in. Do you really think this man murdered these women? Yep. And here comes a big bad wolf. We spare his ass. And a good show, but you know, just take him, okay? Take Crane. Man, they got Crane. Well, this is be a beautiful relationship. Oh my God, I forgot I, about that. I mean it. Out with the old, in with the new. Long live the queen. Woof. That is, she is just some, a bunch of bad news bears. Looks like we're out of our apartment here. Everything looks to be in order. What's going on? Why? What is blood? I wonder. Oh, well then. Oh, bother. Oh, See Jesus. Jeebus learns though. <clears throat> okay, well. Baby's apartment, the so woodland building, early morning. On impact. He'll be okay, though. Hmm? He'll be okay? His internal organs are positively riddled. If I don't extract every single scrap of silver, He's liable to suffer some long-term toxicosis. Easy there. Ouch. Try not to Whoa. move. <laughs> we can't oh, get this God. Way. You think? I figured I'd be done before you were conscious. But there's little I can do for the pain. Swinehart. How bad How is bad it, bro? Is it? Well, not the worst I've seen, but well, dangerous. left to see my I'm kids. Say, you're testing even my skills here. Oh, <laughs> oh my be, don't God! Move. Doctor, look, I'm a bit engaged, saving his life at the moment. But if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. Oh, oh no! Oh, look at that—the the bone. Oh God, that is just super brutal. All right, I guess we're gonna have to. Sick. Hey, I did. Oh, you ass. You know, that wasn't so difficult, was it? That'll do. Oh, better God. Off. This way I won't have to reset it later. He's lucky to be alive. And he won't be Colin. this time if he keeps going like this. He didn't listen to me before. Maybe he'll listen to you. Maybe. I don't know about that. Well, he should. There are limits to what even I can do. This is the job. Yep. What? Just relax. <laughs> Comes with its little perks. I guess we'll give it that. 
Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes. Yeah, I mean, he is pulling dangerous shards I, I of silver out of my spleen. At least until he's out of the woods. Believe me, Bigby couldn't be in better hands, and I need the space to work. So, if you wouldn't mind, I'll be all good. Don't worry, Snow. I'll be okay. Yeah, he'll patch me up. Don't worry. We'll be done in a moment. Just please give us the time. God, man, hey, all Don, that blood. How much longer? Colin, leave him be. It's Colin, finished please. When it's finished. Because I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in ten minutes flat. Colin, you're not even supposed to be what? here right how is... now. How was... Okay. Oh, Shots really? that turtle. Where am I supposed to be? I'm here to take care of my friend. With what? Your hooves? Hey, listen, please, lady. Please, keep it down back there. Thank you. Please, you both of please you. Please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open. Yeah, like yes, for real. would be helpful. It's not a good thing for him to miss one thing and end up taking out my spleen. Uh, there. All done. Oh. Great. He's like teeth. This isn't a habit you should keep to. Having visits with me. And, well, this time. This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Dang. Miss oh. White. <laughs> You'll be fine for light duty, if he can figure out what that means. <laughs> he knows what it means. It's just been... An unusual couple of it's never days. light duty. I know, but please don't give him the excuse. His body will eventually give out. Take care of him, please. I think he likes Swineheart a lot. I will. Like, he'll need rest, oh. I assume. Sleep mostly. Just keep watch and make sure he doesn't get into further altercations. I'm right here, you know. Right here, guys, come on. Come on. Anyway, take care of myself. Guard against, as they say, Miss White. Sheriff. Oh, like I was saying, I really like Swineheart. Oh, all right, I guess they don't like each other very much. Uh, I really like Swineheart. You know, I mean, he, we don't see much of him, but in the times that we do see him, he seems like a really good doctor, and a, he seems like I have a genuine personality. I like it. I really do. Nice. So, how so? do you um, feel? I feel like a guy that just got it's shards of metal so pulled out of his gut, okay. so that's as good as you can get. I've seen him take worse. Not much worse. Not as good as can be expected, I think. Probably. So, not well then. Eh, you've seen better days, so I'll give her that. I'm glad you're not dead. Yeah, me too. But it's good to know she cares. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or. Yeah, you can. I can imagine yes. that amount of pain would make some people stop breathing for a good amount of time. It, um, it kind of scared the hell out of me. Oh, I I've like this moment. Never seen you like that. And when Swineheart arrived, you know him. He's never worried, and even he thought you were. Snow, I'd never leave you. Aww. It's super nice. Yeah, it's super nice you were scene. really fucked up, man. And Colin comes in to ruin the moment. An action figure and bend its limbs the wrong way. <laughs> all right, Colin, Colin, please. I'm just saying, I was worried about him. Is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, oh, I'll get some rest true. when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? What's even happening out there? I mean, do you guys have like a plan or something? And who should I be asking? Should I be worried about the crooked man taking over? Or is Crane still the thing? The Crooked Man, Bloody Mary, Mary. the Tweedles. We got a whole plate full of stuff to take care of. Yeah. The Crooked Man came out of the shadows for a reason. For him to attack us so blatantly like that. He either feels invincible or desperate. Or well, close to it. Those are my two options. I don't think I'd pick desperate. What do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying. That's not exactly something you do when you're playing with house money. So he called my bluff. It's hey, not like I'm going to let Bloody Mary just At least... murder. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Thanks, Snow. For all exactly. that back there. No problem. Thanks. At least we you're escaped to live to fight another day. Or oh, that the crooked man thinks he's got snow under his thumb. We're all mad about it, Colin. 
but it's not like we had a strong choice in the matter. You weren't there, Colin. So just drop it. Yeah, like for real. Okay, okay. I, 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 All I care about right uh, now I don't is know. just what does the crooked man want out of this? Hmm. I thought he was just a loan shark, but clearly he's operating in other circles. Yeah, it sounds like he's got his hand dipped Queen. into a few right. cookie jars. Getting him out of town? Is this all about the murders? Crane can't be useful to him anymore. So what could this have to do with Faith and Lily? Crane was a puppet, and the Crooked Man worked the strings. This is all about yeah. control of Fabled Town. But then what do prostitutes like have to do with it? Lily and Faith? I don't know Those how it all two pieces works actually don't fit together very well in this plan, does. Though, so I don't know. Somehow. The Crooked Man declared war against us last night. That's true. At least that's what I thought when it happened. Seems like now it. Now I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. We need to yep. do things the right way. What is the that right mean? Job. The right way. What do you think I mean? Do you I don't mean? know, but what it suspiciously mean? sounds like your Bigby. way. Bigby's the one on the front lines. You can't give him a leash. He doesn't work that way. Look, I know things haven't gone great recently, but yeah, we're, still we're doing, doing what best. we're doing the best That's of what we're given. Then, uh. so starting now, we do everything cut and dried, by the book, straight as an arrow. Pure Until things driven snow. get a I'm bit coffee turvy. Sure you're not. This town oh, has enough two, man. monsters. What happened last night? What you turned into? What? It can't happen again. Are you serious? We need monsters to fight monsters. Colin, if I really believed that we needed him to lose his flippin' mind at a moment's <laughs> notice, the flippin' mind. Then that would mean I'd lost all faith in our ability to help this town. Just let that side of you be done, okay? We were under attack, Snow. Yeah. What did you expect me? To if do? I hadn't done, if he hadn't there done that, degrees. things wouldn't. Would have gone a lot worse I than they had. Only ever do what's necessary. Really? Yeah. Do you yeah. Believe him? Yeah, I do. Exactly. We Look, could have killed the one of the Tweedles last just night. As much as I care about we didn't. It wasn't so necessary that, at this point in time. Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Exactly. Everybody wants Big B to smile and shave and take a shower now and then. Hell, I'm practically the president of the Big B. Don't be such a dick club. <laughs> But this is the wrong fucking time to put shackles on him. Well, at least someone understands. Honestly, I'm, I'm on Colin's side on this one. He'll get the job done. Just let him do it. Yeah, like... To... We'll follow the rules and we'll do what's necessary do at any point in okay. time. But, like, if things get that... hairy, we're gonna have to get now hairy right I'm back. Mayor, I need your respect. We have... We have... What? You've always and had our respect. Situation. Come on. Has to end. What if you're situation? questioning it, then all unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay. Oh man! Oh, give me a fucking break! Are you gonna let her talk to me like that? It's been the rule for a reason, Colin. Just calm down, Look, everybody. Everyone, just calm down. Right? We're in a bit of a heated tiz tizzy right now, but I'm not. Tell me right now, what's it gonna be, baby? Don't worry, Colin. You're my bro. I'll help you out. You might want to get the phone, lady. Thank you. Wolf's residence. That's rude. Indeed. Lefkin, what is it? Hey, a resident monkey. Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? Bluebeard. Narissa. Narissa. Oh, or not? Broad from the pudding and pie. A lot prettier. Yes. Apparently, she told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about, but that she'll only tell you. What do you think that could be? Uh, Bigby's got an admirer. You always do well with the, uh, disenfranchised. <laughs> something about your prickly demeanor attracts him like a moth to a flame. She knows something. Yeah. She's helped me a little with the case. Maybe she has something else. Unfortunately, it seems like those ribbons tie them to, the to something office. else. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. And I should probably change out of these clothes. You don't say. Consider the discussion tabled, but not over. Let me know when you're done with Nerissa. Aye, aye, Hey, Captain. hey. She's a piece of work. You don't say. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? Don't worry. I got you, bro. I mean, she seemed real serious about it. 
but I can still hang out here. Look, uh, maybe a few will get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. You're my bro. Wouldn't do that to you. You're the one constant in my life that Don't worry uh, about pisses it. me off a little bit, but Thanks, big he's still the bro. You chose friendship over the rules. Hey, I need every time. Every time. Shout out to that sweet picture of the shoe. Oh, angry wounds. Well, here we go.